I feel as though I've always lacked motivation when it comes to life. I think I've always hated living life, period. And it wasn't until the last... I would say it hasn't even been a full year yet. It was in August of 2023 was when everything sort of took a bit of a pleasant change for me. And I can honestly say for the very first time, and I I know I've said this in quite a few videos of mine, but it's always so astonishing when I when I look back at it. I almost started tearing up right there, if you couldn't tell. But the shakiness of, of my of my of my voice there. I'm honestly living in some of the most fondest times in my life and I feel like I'm I have so many memories that I'm going to look back on that is just going to be so lovely. I write a lot in my diary, a bunch. I remember in English class back in back in high school, uh, I always loved my English teachers. My English teachers were always some of the some of my favorite teachers ever, except for one of them in college. He was he was a strange fellow, I'll be honest, but enough about him. I remember this must have been like 10th grade, 11th grade English teacher. And she would have us do this thing where she would have us write in a journal. And I remember thinking it was the stupidest thing ever. I was like, what do I have to write in this journal? I have nothing that I want to talk about. I have nothing that I want to write about. And she would be all like, oh, she would write in her, her journal every day at night before she went to bed. I'm like, lady, you're about lame as hell. <laughs> I love you, but also this is corny as shit. And I remember I started my first diary. I think it was maybe a year, two ago. And I finished that out. I finished out my second one a few days ago. I'm starting a new one. And it is just so interesting to look back on past lives, I guess. It's it's so interesting how much change can happen in the span of a year or even a few months even i talked about this in one video i think it's like where's the time gone or like the the, the silent time of i'll I rem, i'll get the video up it'll be on the top left or top right but it's just so i'm such a different person from last year to this year I am such a different person from even a year or two ago. And it's just so interesting to read my entries of what I was stressed out about, what I wanted to do or what I was scared about till now. I love writing in my diary. I just got off the phone with somebody who showed me who gave me this new motivation for life and i won't lie to you law um you i i'm a bit and i know i i said i i have been a bit scared to say a few things on this channel and on videos i'm a bit scared to say this because i don't want people to like f take it the wrong way or like feel like i'm trying to like foster like parasocial relationships or whatever but like i don't know how to say this without coming across as weird but like doing these videos have really taught me a lot uh, about myself and and just like you lovely people here have done so much for my life that you probably will never never know or ever understand but i, I really want to thank you all and 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 i i just i got off the phone with somebody and they also contributed a lot to this newfound motivation I have for life that I didn't have before. Realistically, I was kind of just living the past year. I was happy, but I was lost. And even though I cannot say for a 100% fact that I know what I'm doing, I mean, does anybody at the end of the day, but... I'm glad that I feel as though that I have a purpose now. Uh, a day, not even a day ago, I lost half of my family. Um, 
<laughs> not in some sort of like freak accident uh estranged estranged um they don't uh, approve of who I am as a person. I'm not exactly sad about it. I've known this was going to happen for a while. Honestly, I was the one who initiated the estrangement. And so I'm kind of chilling, but it's... I'm free. I'm I'm finally free to be myself. And I'm around people who... <laughs> I'm sorry. Um... Um, and, and I, I don't like these pots, like I would say since April, it's just, life's been kind of crazy. I, 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 I try to keep some stuff. I, I shouldn't say some stuff. I try to keep most stuff to myself and I really only talk about it in the diary or if I find like a, a video topic funny enough, I might make a video about it, but I, um, I would also like to apologize to some people because, like, life for me has just been extremely chaotic. I There's so many people I, I've just literally have not spoken to since, like, April because life has just been... <sighs> Hopefully, this video isn't people hearing from me for the first time. Hopefully, I've reached back out to most of you and I've I've talked to you, so... But, um... I'm happy. I feel motivated. I feel like I feel like I actually have a future. Um and I couldn't do that without the help of you lot watching this which also allowed me to find people in my actual life who are just as amazing, who are just as motivated. And I, 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 for the first time, am not scared of the future. That was an insane voice crack. But, um, yeah, I don't know what this video was. I just felt the need to make something. So I did. It's been Eve, Evelyn. I'll... I'll see you when I see you. Peace.